Getting older is the best. As long as you train with weights three times a week, run three times a week, <laughs> take a cold shower and you eat mostly unprocessed and minimally processed foods and you try and get sleep and you limit your alcohol and you work on your traumas, like you're going to have a great freaking life. Hi everyone. Today we are going to create this simple looking yet very nicely designed video. So in the start, okay, first what we need is the background. So to do the background, what we are going to do is simply bring on a default text. Okay, get Windows plus start key over here. Let's select this and increase it. Okay, type this. And as you can see, it's white plus bluish background. So what we can do is simply just, you know, copy this. Just copy this. Okay, and then let's select this bluish color okay let's first make it green yeah now i'm going to select this blue with all plus g to make it a bump on flip and on to video mask add mask and then split and give it something like this okay now i'll just copy this okay and then rotate it like this okay go to the way so you know we have got that bluish at the top and bottom okay you can adjust the you know size or position and achieve your desired look but this is okay for now and then what we are going to do is simply start with the animation so in the start you can see there is this okay calendar so calendar can be made very easily in CapCut only okay first for this background okay for this white background just bring in a default text and then windows plus start key select this okay white okay and increase the you know shape one thing like this and then what we are going to do is simply just hit alt plus g and then head out to video add mask rectangle and then make something like this okay add a bit of curve to this okay and then stun you can bring in your text layers next and then as you can see there are these doubles so just write the numbers okay write this text make a line make this okay so you can just make the line using underscore key so just go here hit underscore key okay let me make it black like this and then you know just make it minus okay so you'll get this line simple line okay and for this part okay this arrow part what you can do is simply just again what you have to do is bring in a default text okay hit two underscores key okay and then just place it like this copy that and then rotate it like this and make one arrow okay put here one and then rotate it and then put here one okay so this way you can complete everything so you know i have just already done this okay let me show it to you i'll bring it over here as you can see i've already made this okay so we can just keep it over here okay something like this okay now in the starting this thing comes down and then there is this blue you know super animation so what we are going to do is simply i'm going to make this bigger okay yeah this looks okay now and on to video basic hit on transform keyframe go ahead and again hit on transform keyframe go to the start and then drag this up okay also i'll be hitting the blend keyframes okay and in the start i can just make this to zero opacity hit or plus k and then you know select this cubic out okay as you can see after this we need to circle the things okay so let's circle these three 25 26 and 27 so again bring on a default text windows plus start key symbols and then circle okay and this time around i'll select this blue color for this circle okay copy this i'll copy this and then i'll bring it inside this okay and then simply what i'm going to do is just put it here okay and let's bring it below 25 okay 
naked digger if i go back you can see you have this okay i'll just delete this as you can see we have got this okay just where we want it to be now i'll just go back again inside and just go here okay now i'm going to animate it here only so what i'm going to do is just you know select this head on to you know transform keyframe go ahead again hit on transform keyframe go to the first keyframe and then make the scale to zero hit odd plus k and then now let's make it cube out okay so now let's see the animation okay perfect now we just need to replicate this okay now it's good now let's see the animation till now but comes down and then there are three this blue animations okay now for the next scene what i'm going to do is simply just make this okay now i'll just copy this head on to video mask and then change the masking to rectangle make something like this bit of curve like this yeah so we have got it now after this comes down we have to bring this okay let's make it a bit bigger okay now let's design it by bringing our logo over here okay keep it over here and then clean three times so i'll just bring in my another default text and write now the animation is simple okay it's you know just scaling up and then text is coming up okay so simply what we have to do is just select these okay and then first i'll just you know take these hit all plus g okay so from pound clip this image and this text okay now what i'm going to do is simply head on to you no know, video animation okay and hit fade in okay and now i'll select this video transform keyframe okay go here again hit video transform keyframe go to the start make this see get out plus k and now let's do the same thing again by hitting q to out now for the next one and just you know first and make it a first i'll select these two okay make it a compound clip then after this is done i'll just you know hit your transform keyframe again go ahead till here take the scaling down a bit put it over here okay it all plus k and then just you know like give it out now you have to make this same animation again yeah so it's looking smooth now after this everything will go back and blur and then this will come now select everything except this white background and these two blue ones and hit compound clock okay so after this you know just hit on transform keyframe go ahead and just shrink it down here at all plus k then go back out okay and then we can head on to effects search for hazy bring on here hazy okay increase the blur and make this full everything and then from here what we can do is just make this full okay so after this you know when this starts to go back i'll just bring my easy effect here hit on this go ahead again hit on this somewhere around here wait yeah and then go to the first keyframe and bring everything to zero okay not at all plus k 
and then smoothen this out too and then what we can do is bring in our new set of assets which is this okay let me just you know mirror it put it over here like this okay bring the shower again mirror it put it here like this okay then just bring in this okay so this image or this video of the shower i got it from envato elements but what you can do is if you want it for free as this was paid if you want it for free then you can head on to youtube and you can get this type of you know elements for free so just search for you know water falling down or shower you know green screen something like that now i just head on to screen okay and then put it over here okay so we'll get this now you can see there is this effect okay so this comes up okay then this is that okay so what we can do is simply just you know bring this over here put it like this and write whatever text you want okay so you get this and then next is this so now just select everything except the shower okay and make it a compound clip and then what we can do is after this comes so just you know in click here and hit on cradle animation select this also I can fade in okay let's bring this over here a bit you know late into the animation so just again bring this okay i'll just turn on to mask circle and then you know mask it out the food okay make it bigger okay put it over here and you know from here what we can do is just hit on transform keyframe go ahead and just bring it over here okay and rotate it a bit and then hit alt plus k and again let's you know head on cubic out and simultaneously just shorten this up over here and you know animation out and fade it out okay so when this comes in you have to fade this out okay and then again as you can see there is this same thing and then in the end again animation from the again this same animation which we did at the start which is this one okay so with this the animation is over hope you learned something new see you in the next